Hello, welcome to Linda Likes Tarot. Hi, my name is Linda. If you're new, welcome. If you're returning, what's up? I'm glad that you're back. Okay, so today this reading is going to be for a specific sign. We are both going to find out what that sign is together, okay? Please don't forget to hit the like button and the subscribe button. It is greatly appreciated and it does help out the channel. Listen, this is a general reading. Not everything is going to resonate with you. It's not supposed to. So pick up what does resonate with you and drop the rest for someone else to appreciate. Remember, do not make life-changing decisions off watching tarot. Watch tarot responsibly, okay? Always get your final confirmation from the divine. All right? All right. Okay, so before we even find out who this sign is for, all right, or this reading is for, um, I was hearing... <laughs> I was hearing this song from Tyga. It goes, uh, brown, 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 bitch, I'm a star. <laughs> rack city, bitch, rack, rack city, bitch. That's all I kept hearing. Okay, so let's find out who's getting racks in the city. <laughs> I'm just joking. Um, hold on. Dude, okay, so the number 44 could be very significant for somebody. You need to know that you are loved, you're deserving of love, and you are lovable, okay? Whoever this is for. Okay, so the song um, by Tyga, I think I'm saying it right, uh, it's called Rack City. It starts off by him going, uh, him going, rack, rack, city, bitch, rack, rack, city, bitch, okay? And then he goes, rack city bitch okay let me just get to the point he goes i'm a motherfucking star look at the paint on the car too much rim make the ride too hard tell that bitch hop out walk the boulevard <laughs> i need i need my money pronto get it in the morning like alonzo rondo green got cheese like a nacho if you ain't got no ass bitch wear a pon okay listen let me not trigger the gas dang app with these words. Okay, so listen. <laughs> this is a song. I feel like whoever I'm speaking to, you gets the hundreds. Because it goes throwing hundreds. Hundreds. You guys could have kicked somebody out of your life. And now your prosperity is going up. Or your life is going good. Something like that. Or maybe this is what is going to happen. Maybe you guys are all sad because you you cut someone out of your life. You need to know that um, this was the best possible thing for you. Bar, bar fresher than a motherfucking peppermint. Something about peppermint. Maybe you guys need to drink peppermint tea or something about something being fresh. Or this is talking about your fresh start. Why does my music stop playing? Somebody wants to put a stop to your fresh start. Somebody wants to put a stop to you getting rack rack city bitch. <laughs> Whatever that means. Somebody wants to stop you from getting hundreds or something, child. I don't know. Please don't stop the music. Why do I keep getting that song? Let's find out who this is. Someone here wants you to stop doing something, but fuck that. Okay, maybe someone wants you to stop. Um, you know what else I'm getting? Like, whoever this reading is for, someone wants you to stop searching for something. Somebody wants you to stop uh, looking into something, or they want you to stop asking them questions, or something. Or this is someone who doesn't like to be questioned. I don't know, child. Ooh, okay, so this card right here says raise or promotion. We have congratulations. It says an increase in your abundance flow awaits you. This is a result of your positive focus and willingness to take action based on your divine guidance. So keep up the good work. So whoever I'm speaking to, keep up the good work. And congratulations, you did something. You did something good? Someone really wants to stop this. This is really symbolic. Someone wants to stop you from receiving something. I'm going to change the song because maybe it's the song, Joe. 
I'm a motherfucking star. Maybe you're shining brightly right now and someone doesn't like how brightly you're shining. Okay. Maybe someone wants this to stop. Maybe someone doesn't want to see you shine so bright. We'll just keep it here. But it, it won't stop. Can't stop. Your shine will continue to shine. Let their eyes burn, bitch. That's what I say. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what's going on? What is happening? Very strange. Maybe I should put it over here. I don't know. Maybe y'all need to be in silence right now for whoever this sign is for. Like, you need to be, um, you need to be to yourself at this time, okay? Give yourself a moment of silence. Let me go to, let me see what sign. Come on. I'm also getting like someone here wants to stop you from having hope. Someone wants to kill the hope that you have inside of you. But it's like, you can't kill hope. Let me see. This is wild. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what zodiac sign is this reading for? This is this. Scorpio, did I do you already? I'm, I did. I did you from March already. You guys could be dealing with a Scorpio or someone who has Scorpio somewhere in their chart. There's something here about... Um, it could be something here about you being purified, like you purifying your energy of something. But I'm also getting like... Something about a rebirth. Um, Pisces. Someone here could be a Pisces or they could have Pisces somewhere in their chart. Did I do Pisces yet? I don't think I did. Let me see. I did Leo, Capricorn, Aries, Scorpio, Virgo, Aquarius, Pisces. This reading is for you. Okay. Bitch, you're a star. Bum, bum, bum. <laughs> Let me stop. Okay. So Pisces, this is your reading. Tell me more, Spirit. What's going on? What's going on with my Pisces? Why is it so secretive? Why does this energy feel like we have to be quiet about something? We have Leo. Someone here could be a Leo or have Leo somewhere in their charts. You could be dealing with one. Okay, there's something here about you having to take a chance here or someone wants to take a chance on you. Maybe they're trying to... Someone's trying to make moves in silence or maybe this is what you're being asked to do. We got Cancer. Someone here could be a Cancer or they could have Cancer somewhere in their chart. Someone definitely here could be in their feelings about something here, okay, or about you, okay? This is someone from your past that wants to return, Pisces, okay? Someone's trying to find the courage and the strength to come in and tell you something that they hid from you, or they want to clear up some sort of secret. We got Virgo. Someone here could be a Virgo, or they could have Virgo somewhere in their, somewhere in their chart, It's like someone here is trying to figure out what's the source of your power, what's the source of what keeps you going, what keeps you hopeful. Someone wants to know, like, someone's trying to get you to be powerless. So they're, they're trying to find, like, a, a weakness within you. That's their goal. That's their plan. What is going on? This is so weird. Ooh, I'm just going to stop it. My right ear just went weird. I'm just going to stop it. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what's going on with my Pisces? What do they need to hear at this time? Any other signs? Okay. 
That's a lot. Okay, so Libra, you guys could be dealing with a Libra or you could have Libra somewhere in your chart. We have Aries. Some of you could be dealing with an Aries or you could have Aries somewhere in your chart or Capricorn. You guys could be dealing with a Capricorn or you could have Capricorn somewhere in your chart. Listen, um, someone here is in their feelings because they could have been trying to compete with you and they couldn't, um, they couldn't dominate you or they couldn't like Get one over on you. This is someone here who underestimated your strength. Okay, Pisces. Mm. And someone here broke the rules. We have Taurus at the bottom of the deck. You guys could be dealing with a Taurus or someone who has Taurus somewhere in their chart. Or there's something here about someone here breaking the rules when it comes to finances, resources, or how they, or how they um how they acquire something maybe someone here acquired their spiritual knowledge through some a negative source or something here i don't know hopefully this works child but if it don't work i'm gonna get married Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what's going on here? What do they need to know? Listen, it doesn't matter. You're going to be getting some sort of raise or promotion here, Pisces. What is going on here for my Pisces? What do they need to hear at this time? So we have trust in reverse. So there's somebody here that you lost your trust with or someone here you no longer trust. It says, I accept that my inner voice will always guide me correctly. Okay. Or maybe someone here is upset because they didn't listen to the inner voice. We have shadow here. Maybe somebody here did not listen to their intuition. They Instead, they listened to their shadow okay they knew better so this could have been somebody here that um wanted to have power and control or wanted to have some form of power over you they their intuition was telling them not to do something and they did it anyway okay someone ignored the signs and the synchronicities or synchronicities this could be a mother figure for some of you. Don't have to be. You could be a mother figure or you could be this empress here. Okay. Or someone did this because your light irritated their demons. Okay. Because you a motherfucking star. Mom. <laughs> Stop. No, but for real. Um, I'm also getting another thing too here. This is annoying. Uh, somebody here didn't trust their intuition. When it came to somebody that they slept with, somebody here could have really, somebody here could have instantly got pregnant, like a one night stand pregnancy or something here. I don't know. This could be you or someone else, child. But someone here could be in heartache and in, in feeling like they lost something because you no longer trust them. All right. Or somebody here lost something because they didn't follow their intuition. I'm also getting like, you need to listen to your fucking intuition, Pisces, because if you don't listen to it, you're going to lose out on something or you might you know reap the consequences that don't seem like they're the best okay let me fix this because this is bothering me something here could be bothering you maybe someone keeps bothering you i don't know who fucking knows So I don't know if you heard that in the distance, but that's a, um, that was a motorcycle. So someone here could drive a motorcycle. This could be you or someone else. Please work. No. <sighs> what is going on? It's like somebody here really wanted to connect something or force something to work and it didn't work. Someone here could be feeling sad. Maybe someone was trying to do something to you and it didn't work. Okay. Someone here could be like upset because of some sort of achievement that you have made or because of the house that you have. I don't know what's going on. Some, you brought out the demon out of someone because of some sort of achievement or an area that you live i don't know what this is or something about your family maybe this is someone in your family 
that's in the shadow, okay? Or they did something out of their shadow towards you. How many more? Someone here could be 34 years old, or there's something here about the number 34. Someone here could be 33 as well. Something about the number seven. Something here about your growth, your spiritual growth. You have grown to a certain degree to where someone someone is upset about it. Okay, because maybe because you're in this abundant energy. Maybe someone liked it when you were in like this sad, mopey energy. Okay, when you didn't know how to trust your intuition, possibly. I don't know, Joe. You're going to be receiving some sort of recognition and reward here. That's all I know. There's a lot of threes. This could have been a whole group of people who are feeling this heartache and loss energy. All right. They could be feeling trapped in fear or there's somebody here that's going to jail. Spiritual jail or physical jail for something here. Someone here could be 38. Someone here could be 48. Someone here could be born in 1983, 1984. Don't have to be. Or in 1989. We have solitude at the bottom of the deck. There's something here about being in solitude, something about here being in silence. I'm just not gonna even play with that music anymore. I don't even I'm over it. Listen, maybe some of you maybe you guys are musicians or you do something with like um I don't know, music. You sing, you play an instrument, I don't know. Um and maybe somebody here was trying to make you feel discouraged from going after like something that you do here when it comes to the arts okay this could be somebody in your family um this could be a close friend an ex-lover something here all right i don't know what's this yeah, we have obstacles and challenges here something here is going to get revealed to you about who this person was who was bringing you obstacles and challenges this could have been a whole group that were celebrating you going through some sort of challenges, some sort of adversity. Oh my lord. And see, this is the thing. They did not count on you being courageous. This is why they failed at something. Because you are courageous. They didn't think they, that you had it in you or something here. Child. Someone here could have been doing magic in order to cause these problems for you. You're going to find out who the fuck this is. Um... Fuck it, let's find out who this is right now, child. Who was this person who was um sending them obstacles and challenges, spirit? Who is this person sending them obstacles and challenges? We have Libra, and we have the Chinese zodiac sign of a goat. So this could have been a Libra who has the Chinese zodiac sign of a goat, or just a Libra or someone who has this goat. Okay. That was trying to send you obstacles and challenges. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, tell me more. We got Twin Flame Capricorn. Someone here could have been obsessed with your Twin Flame. Okay, maybe this is why someone was trying to um, send you obstacles and challenges. Okay. Or someone here was jealous of you and your Twin Flame. Tell me more, Spirit. We have Aries. Somebody here could be an Aries or they could have Aries somewhere in their chart. This could be your emperor here. Someone's upset because um, maybe your emperor has some form of stability. Maybe your emperor, maybe your emperor is uh, well off or something. I don't know. Someone here is upset about this though. What in the hell is going on, child? This could be a Virgo that's upset. Somebody here definitely planned something. We have they planned it. Listen, I feel like what you're being asked to do is set some time alone by yourself and think back on certain events that happened in your life, especially certain events that happened at a home or certain events that led up to like something happening. Like maybe somebody got you arrested. Like think about... The events that happened that, I don't know, something here is not, something doesn't add up. Listen, you're going to be receiving help here, whoever I'm speaking to you at this time. What are these motherfuckers playing is my question. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what are they playing? Pinnacle of success. 
So someone here was trying to get some form of success off of you. Being left in the dark. You not knowing something. Something is going to be revealed in the next few weeks. You're going to have fun here during the summer. Okay. Tell me more. What do you have? They planned it. I'm a motherfucking stone. Eight of swords. Self, entra self entrapment. Someone here entrapped themselves. This could have been a drama queen or someone here who was trying to create drama somewhere in your life. This person is now in some sort of crisis. Their hands are tied. They're in between... Uh, what do they call it? A rock in a hard place? Somebody is having a lot of negative thoughts about you having something good happen to you in the summer. Probably something here happening with you meeting your twin flame or something. A king of coins. I told you, somebody here is financially wealthy or something. Your twin flame, your partner, your divine union partner or whatever. Okay. This person is going to be financially stable. They're going to have a strong sense of self-worth. They're going to be hardworking, dependable, successful, grounded, abundant, secure, and stable. I'm also getting like whoever I'm speaking to, you could be, okay, you could be stable and successful and abundant and all this other stuff. And someone here was trying to get you in the eight of swords. Someone here was trying to get you either locked up or something. They were trying to plan you to get set up to get locked up. I'm also getting another thing too. You guys could have had a wealthy man trying to lock you up. Someone here who's, uh, this could have even been someone who's a Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Don't have to be though. That was trying to get you locked up. I could see this in so many different ways. Or someone here is trying to avoid being locked up by the summer. Or someone's, I don't know. Who knows, child? Is someone watching me from prison? I don't, what is this? What is this? We have a uh, page of wands. You're going to be getting some good news here. Whoever I'm speaking to, you're going to be getting some good news. You're going to be receiving some sort of help. You could be going through some sort of obstacle or challenge here. What if you have trust in reverse? Maybe, maybe you trusted somebody you weren't supposed to, child. I don't know. Someone here is scared, though. We have I'm scared. Someone's scared they didn't listen to their intuition. They also want to say I'm sorry because they didn't listen to their intuition. What is going on? This whole we this whole reading is weird. I'm gonna be honest with you. Can you tell me more, Spirit, from my Pisces? Ay, yeah, 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 yeah. What's going on with my Pisces? Okay, so we have nine of cups here. Someone's upset because and scared because your wishes are coming true. And because you're happy and you're satisfied in life, you're self-sufficient, someone is scared about this. Dark to light. A few days. It's time. Act now. Fresh start. Awakening. Spring. You being, uh, your wishes are coming true during this spring equinox, I guess. And someone's scared about this wish or these dreams coming true for you. They had... They were invested in something here or they had something to gain for you to lose. Why do we have on scared? Or someone that's scared because you're single? What is this? Nine of swords. Someone wants to rush in. They want to communicate with you. Or someone here is scared because they did something impulsive. They were impatient. They did something dairy, daring. They thought they or they're or they're scared because of something that they said that was blunt. Okay. Somebody here about to get the ten of coins, bitch. This could have been your whole community. A whole community is scared of you. Because they lost something and you're gaining something. Ciao. They want to say sorry. Sorry. Because I'm... <laughs> I can't. Why do we have I'm sorry? Okay. Tell me more. Someone no longer wants to be like in and out. 
Okay. What do we have? I'm sorry. This is, but this is, <laughs> this is because they're in trouble. We have friend, acquaintance, or coworker. So you have a friend or an acquaintance or a coworker that now wants to say that they're sorry. Tell me more. But this is because they get in trouble. Someone here wants to um, come in as your partner or your companion. Your friend may want to be with you. Okay. Maybe they did something fucked up and now they want to say sorry. I don't know. We have family or past connection. For some of you, this could be a friend, a coworker, an acquaintance that's sorry. This could be an ex-partner that's sorry. This could be a family member that's sorry. This person could be a Sagittarius or they could have Sag somewhere in their chart. Tell me more. What do we have? I'm sorry. This could be a false flame for some of you that wants to come in and say that they're sorry because they did something impulsively. Okay. Someone knows that you're about to have some sort of wish fulfillment here. Yeah, someone here who has the Chinese zodiac sign of the rabbit. Note the date. They could be sorry. Ay, ay, ay. Tell me more, spirit. What's going on? Why do we have all this in the middle? Bad news. Someone here is going to be receiving some sort of bad news bears. Maybe someone here has to leave a home or someone here has to move out. Maybe someone here is getting evicted, okay, for some sort of negative intent that they had for you, okay? Or they're getting bad news bears because they can't keep some sort of house that they stole. That's for some of you, not all y'all. Someone here is definitely watching the fuck out of you. <clears throat> Who's watching them, Joe? Who's watching my Pisces? Another Pisces could be watching you. Okay, interesting. Or a hidden enemy is definitely watching you. Chow. <laughs> Who's watching my Pisces, spirit? Um, a soulmate. So this could be a family member or a close friend. We have coming in to, or an ex. Or, um, and then we have support. Coming in to nurture and support you. So you have somebody here that you once thought was a soulmate that's coming in to try to act like they want to nurture and support you. Or the person that's getting bad news bears who's watching you. Okay. They could be a Pisces or they could be a Taurus. Okay. Flip it where it needs to go, child. Who's this person with getting the bad news bears? Bitch, I'm a star. <laughs> Let me stop. We have dragon. Someone here could have the Chinese zodiac sign of a dragon. Someone here could be a false flame of yours. Or this false flame is going to be receiving bad news during this dragon year. Bad news bears for something that they did. Either... They're getting bad news bears because they sent some sort of negative entity or some sort of negative energy to, or wishes towards your home or towards your foundation or towards some sort of achievement that you have or to your family, your children, something, whatever it was, child. Um, either this was a spiritual negative intent or a physical one. Regardless of the situation, someone getting fucked up, okay? And somebody watching you. For why? I don't know. Let's find out. Why is this person watching them? Why is this person watching my Pisces? Nine of Wands. They're watching you be courageous, set boundaries, have grit, be determined, have faith. They're watching you endure all the shit that they're putting you through. Someone liked watching you struggle. We have the Ten of Wands at the bottom of the deck. So, okay, so there's someone here that was watching you struggle. Somebody wanted to watch you struggle. This is a sick son of a bitch. This is over, though, whatever this is. It's done. It's completed. And now someone's going to have to reap some fucking karma here. Um, Why do we have the guy staying tra uh, trapped in here? for that? Somebody did something to a child. Maybe someone's going to jail because they did something to a child. You could be this child that somebody did something to. Or someone here was trying to jail you, but you were innocent. Or someone was trying to trap you in fear, but you were innocent of something. Maybe someone was trying to spiritually or physically attack you, um, but you were innocent the entire time. Maybe someone thought you were doing something to them and you weren't, okay? Maybe somebody thought you did something to their ve their vehicle or something that they did for work. Okay. Somebody gonna get somebody getting rich, child. I don't know what this is, but um. Listen, 
Maybe somebody thought you stole money from them or something. Maybe somebody thought that they you gave them a bad transaction or something like that. Or somebody thought the reason why you got good luck was because you did something wrong or you did something bad or something. But that's not the case. You're innocent of something here. You have a loved one here from your community, your family, your friend group, something that loves you. Or somebody tried to put you in this fearful energy or tried to watch you go through burdens and strife because they're upset because someone loves you. Okay. Why do you have that news? Yeah, somebody watching you. Somebody's watching you. They're spying on you. This person got problems. They're stuck too. So all this person is left to do is just watch you stuck in their life. I'm also getting somebody wanted to see you be stuck, but that's not happening. That shit's done. Whoever I'm speaking to, that shit's done. That's not going to happen. They're done. Finally cooked. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, tell me more. What's going on with my Pisces? What do we need to know? What do we need to hear? This is someone here who is definitely laughing at your pain, child. This could have been a tarot card reader that was hating on you or you're a tarot card reader and this person was hating on the fact that you read cards, okay? Or you're spiritual and they're just a spiritual hater. Flip it where it needs to go, child. But somebody here was definitely laughing at your pain, trying to put you through shit, sending things to your home or something. Yeah, you're gonna you're going to have some sort of new beginning, okay? And you're going to be having some sort of money returning to you. Maybe someone here was stealing money from you or stealing something from you, okay? Energy, something like that. Tell me more what's going on with my Pisces when it comes to this fertility. And yeah, nighttime in reverse. Someone wants you to shut up. So there's someone here that wants you to shut up. They want you to stop talking. Someone was trying to do this by, you know, making you take a very long nap. Tell me more, spirit. Yeah, you're going to be receiving some sort of new love here. You're being asked to stay resilient, okay? Or someone didn't expect you to be resilient. There's someone here you cannot trust. <sighs> Who's this person they can't trust, spirit? A rat? You can't You can't trust someone here who has the Chinese zodiac sign of a rat. Or this is you. Flip over needs to go. But this person cannot be trusted. Maybe this is someone here who's going to... Be careful what you communicate to somebody, okay? Because there's someone here who's on your ass, Pisces. We have Scorpio. Someone here could be a Scorpio or they could have Scorpio somewhere in their chart that you cannot trust. Or this is someone here who wants revenge against you. Or this is someone here who's holding on to a secret. Or this is someone here who is going to tell your secret. We have um, family or past connection could be someone you cannot trust. And then we have Aquarius. Someone here could be an Aquarius that you cannot trust, okay? That's a friend, a past connection, or part of your family. Okay, they're going to be exposed for planning something here. Let's see what the heck is going on. What else is going on for my Pisces spirit? What's going on with my Pisces? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what's going on with my Pisces? What do they need to know at this time? What do my Pisces need to know? Ooh. Skirt! We have Quick Getaway, The Runner Escaping. So someone here is trying to escape something here. Maybe trying to escape some sort of responsibilities here. Tell me more. Cock blocking inaccessible third party interference failed sexual attempts okay maybe somebody here was trying to sleep with you i don't know anymore. or whoever this runner is somebody that didn't want to commit to you they've been trying to block your love life tell me more that's for some of you not all y'all we have splitsville man okay so somebody is leaving someone apparently we have splitsville Excuse me, has separation, breaking up, leaving it behind. So someone's leaving somebody, okay? They don't want to be with them anymore. Maybe this a happy house is not a home or something like that, or their home is not a happy place. I don't know. Tell me more. We have booty call. Someone is escaping to a booty call, or maybe someone might call you for a booty call. Someone here, or somebody here was in, in a relationship with someone, and they realized that the only reason they were with them was because of sex. 
it was just a sexual connection. That's it. Tell me more, spirit. What's going on with my Pisces? We have influencer. It says, in the spotlight, persu persuading others, following the leader. Um, so someone here... Someone here could have influenced someone to come towards you to, to attempt to have sex with you. Or they got in the way of somebody from coming towards you who, who, who's sexually attracted to you. Tell me more what's going on. You could be in the spotlight. You could be an influencer. Place where it needs to go. We have knocked up. Someone's pregnant. Someone here could be running away from a pregnancy or somebody being pregnant whatever it is we have baby on the way expecting someone is leaving separation breaking up leaving it behind leaving behind someone being knocked up damn that's fucked up what's the bottom of the deck we have spiritual narcissists it's a spiritually e egotistical spirit superiority complex spiritual manipulation somebody here could have um used some sort of dark magic and it backfired on them and now Somebody here could have been trying to block your achievements, your foundations, your achievements. I already said that. Your um, love life, all that other stuff. And it backfired and resulted in somebody being left behind while being pregnant or something. Damn, Jesus Christ. Tell me more. This person is not spiritually woke. Whoever they were having this sexually based relationship with. This person lacks self-awareness. This is someone here who um, couldn't see something for a while. This is someone who's very much still in their ego or something. Tell me more. We have be right back. It says time apart, communication delays, left waiting. Somebody go someone. What the fuck is going on? We have switching up, reintroduce, acting brand new, new persona. Child, please. Is someone going to come in trying to offer something to you while they have someone pregnant <laughs> somewhere else? What is going on? I also feel like whoever this person who's walking away from someone that they are, um, that they got pregnant, this person, this is the masculine energy that's walking away. This person could have been talking shit to this person that is pregnant with their baby about you. They were talking shit about you. And now this person's switching up being like, oh no, never mind. I want to be with Pisces. What the fuck is this? Is this because someone misses you? Someone misses you, Pisces? <laughs> what the fuck is this? Love on the brain, talking often, feeling all the feels. Tell me more. This is messy. We have badass. It says confident, bold, forced to be working with, taking no shit. So maybe when you were dealing with this person in the past, they, they escaped, they ran away because you're too, you're too fucking smart. You're too confident. Someone here can't manipulate you when you're too smart or too confident. So they went to someone else, to a booty call, somebody that they just have a sexual relationship with, someone that they could easily manipulate and control because they're not spiritually woke. And whoever I'm speaking to, you leveled up in some way or you're about to. And when you do, this person's going to come back. They're going to abandon this poor child back here, <laughs> this poor girl, and try to switch up and come to you. This is disgusting. Someone's trying to manifest you. Mm. Someone's like saying like, oh, I didn't ghost you. I, uh, I was, I'm just going to be right back. Like, I don't know. Someone's going to try to switch something up try to explain their way trust your intuition please because this person's a hot mess we have graduation day you're leveling up yeah you've already learned your lesson you already acquired the much needed wisdom that you needed for this person or for this situation someone's gonna come in appearing as somebody that they're not okay they're gonna be trying to sugarcoat some things maybe someone's gonna be like trying to like backpedal on some shit they were talking about you Okay, someone here wants to come in and have some sort of Netflix and chill situation with you. Hell, 
no. Hell no. <laughs> Hell no. Okay. Listen to your intuition, please. And if this isn't like a romantic lover situation, this could be like, you know, a fucked up fake friend coming back, switching up, trying to be like, oh, um, I'm sorry, and I was wrong, and I didn't know, and whatever the hell. Don't trust it, please. Don't trust it. Even if it's a family member, don't trust it. Because someone here, someone here is trying to plan to get you caught up somehow. Because whatever magic they're using or doing, it's not working. And there's a lot of, like, money at stake, I feel like. For whoever I'm speaking to, there's a lot of money at stake. Or there's a lot for someone to lose. And they're trying to avoid losing it. Let's get our big brother. What time is it? Ciao. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what's going on? What do my Pisces need to hear? Okay, so we have bum, no job, no motivation, loser, lack mindset. So there's someone here that is a bum and they need money. We have Destiny's Child says, I'm a survivor. I'm a survivor. I'm gonna make it. So you could have been in a relationship with a bum, a loser. You survived this relationship. This, this bum wants to come back. This could be an Aquarius, Pisces, Cusp. Don't have to be. Or flip it where it needs to go, child. This is you. I don't know. Tell me more. We have karmic father. So this could be a karmic baby father of yours. I don't know. Or someone's karmic father is involved. We have 555. Something here is unexpected. Or something here is definitely about to change. Maybe somebody just lost their job because of some sort of backfire here. And now they're going to come towards you because they need to... They're coming towards you out of survival. We have codependent partner. Okay, you guys could be dealing with a codependent partner. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, tell me more. Or this person is. We have... Or they're trying to run away from a codependent partner. We have stay to yourself at this time. So you're being asked to stay, at your, stay to yourself at this time. We have wrongly convicted. So someone here could have wrongly convicted you of something. Whoever this person who's in the lack mindset it says wondering why you're still alive death spell so somebody could have done this to you and now every everything in their life is dying they wanted everything in yours to die even your you holy spirit holy angels can you tell me more what's going on okay so we have pretending to be spiritual to be with you yeah so somebody here is going to come in they're going to try to act like they want to be spiritual because they're, they're doing this out of survival this person does not even love you you're somebody here who's shining. You have a winning resume, okay? You're a motherfucking star. <laughs> That's why someone wants to come in, child. They want to come in and use you. Yeah, we have lesson is learned. I feel like whoever I'm speaking to, you've already learned your lesson when it comes to this person. Also, I'm getting, you could have been the one who was pregnant that this person left. Okay? And now they want to come back. Your baby daddy want to come back. Child, please. Because you're doing well now. Mm. Tell me more. What's going on? We have hospitals. Someone here might end up going to the hospital. <laughs> Jesus. Someone here might end up getting sick. Okay. Or someone's sick to their stomach because you're happy. Someone here could be throwing up a lot. Okay. Or if this is you that's throwing up a lot, you might be pregnant. Or maybe this you're going through some sort of ascension. Maybe this is like an ascension symptom for you. Holy Spirit, tell me more. We have Pisces, Aries, Cusp, so this could be you, or this could be the person that's pretending to come in and be spiritual. I don't know, flip it where it needs to go. You need to know that you are protected. We have 444. Tell me more. We have Lion King, remember who you are. Remember the lessons you learned from this person or this is experience, okay? Remember why it didn't work in the first place, okay? Remember your value. Remember your worth. Remember your mission here on this planet. We have 666. Okay, you guys can be seeing 666 a lot. Something here is definitely going to be balanced. Okay. We have guilt. Someone here could feel guilty. Ooh, damn. Okay, so there's someone here. Okay, so someone here could have wrongly accuse somebody of something and it backfired and they got arrested 
someone feels guilty or if someone here was playing with magic or just telling lies and rumors, some sort of lie and rumor got out of control and it caused someone else to get locked up or to get sick or so I don't know, Joe. But someone feels guilty. Someone knows that they're the cause of something that happened to someone that was bad. We have July. Something could have happened in July or something's going to happen in July. Someone here could be a Cancer or a Leo. We have boss is hoping you let them smash. Oh, that's gross. Okay. We have dark coven. So someone here definitely is in a dark coven here that could have wrongly convict you of something. Okay. They could have been trying to get you to put, put in the hospital. We have stepmom. Somebody here could be um, a stepmom. You could be a stepmom. This person could be a stepmom or your stepmom out here is weird. I don't know. We have staged accident or death here. Someone here could have staged some sort of accident or death when it comes to you. Because you're happy. Tell me more. What the hell is going on? We got coworker, your coworker out here is involved in this situation. Someone's trying to make sure someone doesn't say anything. Maybe there's no, a witness here that wants to say something that could end up being in the hospital because someone is trying their best to, something just is progressively getting worse. <laughs> like, <laughs> Something progressively keeps getting worse. Something's a fucking mess. Why do we have dark coven? Who's in this bitch? Someone here who's in a dark coven could have the Chinese zodiac sign of a monkey. Note the date, or this is you. Who's in this dark coven? Sir? Someone here who has the Chinese zodiac sign of a rabbit. Note the date. Could be in a dark coven. Who is in this dark coven? These bum ass motherfuckers. A false flame. Your false flame could be part of this dark coven. Tell me more, child. Who's in this dark coven? Someone here who has the Chinese zodiac sign of a snake. Note the date. Or this could be yours. Flip it where it needs to go. Who's in this dark coven, spirit? A Capricorn. There could be a Capricorn here who's part of some sort of dark coven. There could be a Pisces here. Another Pisces that's in this dark coven. Or someone who has Pisces somewhere in their chart. And someone here who has the Chinese zodiac sign of the dragon. Ciao. This tart, this, this tart. The fuck? Someone's name could be Tara. I also sounds like it was, I was going to say Target. Someone, this dark coven made you a target and now they feel guilty because of some, maybe some bum ass person in their coven lied about something. I don't know. Do they even have ethics in a dark coven? Like, do they follow? <laughs> I don't know. Let me stop. Why do we have dark coven? What, what is this about? This dark coven. about mercury hmm. dark coven. what is up with this dark coven someone could be 24 in this dark coven or 25 years old they do something with sexuality and something with their communication so whoever's part of this dark coven there's something here with their voice where it's like a love spell or some shit or they get people in a trance. They do this because they try to get someone's sexual energy with this Venus energy out here. This Venus card. That's how they achieve power and status. Is through taking someone's spiritual or sexual energy. Their chakral energy. That's how they make improvements in their lives. This dark coven. I'm over it. <sighs> Tell me more, spirit. What's going on with my Pisces? We have Leo. There's a Leo that feels guilty 
or you're a Leo. I don't know, child. We got Leo here, though. There's a Leo here that could be in the hospital or feels guilty, or there's a Leo who's part of some sort of dark, dark coven, or we have asked for a badge number. Okay, so somebody here might try to get you falsely arrested for something. We got 777, okay? Spiritual growth. Someone here could have been upset with you because you grew. We have believe in yourself. Someone was upset because you believed in yourself. Or they di they didn't think that you were going to continue to believe in yourself after everything that they put you through. We have Cancer Leo Cusp. Someone here could be a Cancer Leo Cusp. Um, or, yeah. Damn. That is wild. They really are astonished by the fact that you're still alive because of something. Someone is unwelcomed to a dark coven now. <laughs> what? Someone here is going to, someone in this dark coven is experiencing some sort of divorce, can, canceled events. They're, they're feeling unwelcomed when they go to certain places. They're feeling like they have a lack of support now, or there's some sort of disunion inside of a dark coven. Like they're all fighting with each other. They all could, they could be having family problems. They were all trying to do something. They they refused to let go of control. Or now they're deciding to let go of control. Because you just keep leveling up with this three, the three of wands. This is something that they didn't expect that was going to happen for you. Child, let's get out the let's get these out. Let's just to see. Nah. What's going on? What's going on with my Pisces? What do they need to hear at this time, Spirit? What do my Pisces need to hear at this time? We have this person is your ex. So your ex is heavily involved in this situation. They watching you, spying on you. We have, they distort the truth to people to make you look like an evil bitch. So pe this person wants everyone to think you're evil and you're a bitch. And blase, blase. We have, they ask their spirit team every day to make your life miserable. So this is what they've been wishing upon you. And now it's going to be happening to them. We have, they're, they're mad because you truly don't care. So someone's mad because you don't give a shit. Your, a, your ex is mad because you don't care about them anymore. You don't give a fuck. They can feel you being detached um, energetically. And they don't like that because they need your energy in order to be abundant and prosperous. And to manifest good things in their life. To improve things in their life. It's like this person was like upset. Like it was like your ex was like, if I can't have you, if I can't have you to use you, then you better, you're better off dead. Like I'd rather have you gone. Basically, that's the gist of it with this whole wondering why you're still alive is out here. This, it, someone has some control issues. We have this hater has narcissistic tendencies. So this person is a narcissist or they have narcissistic uh, tendencies. Someone here was definitely going on some sort of like smear campaign about you. We have this hater secretly adores you and wants to be close to you. This is a, this is a psychopath, bro. What is going on? They hate you. They love you. They don't know what they want. Tell me more. We have, then you have an old friend. So we have, this is an old friend. So you have an old friend as well. That's upset because you don't care. So a lot of people that you walked away from because you saw them as being sus or being negative or whatever, you said deuces or, or simply people you just don't resonate with anymore. With anymore. They could have gotten salty because you um, cut ties with them. You stopped hanging out with them or something. We have this person projects their text, their talks at chow. Somebody projects their toxicity on you because they're jealous. So somebody here is jealous of you, child. Whatever. We have um, this hater befriended your lover to plant lies in their head about you. So you got a weird ass friend trying to be weird, trying to cock block 
um, somebody who loves you from being with you. We have this hater quietly antagonizes and prods. And when someone finally gets fed up with their shenanigans, they play innocent. Like they have no idea what provoked that reaction. Child, if someone here is getting locked up or is in jail or is experiencing negative karma, this person is playing the fucking victim. They're trying to act like they're the innocent one in the situation and they are not. Okay. That's another thing that I'm getting. Okay, Pisces. What do they need to do, Spirit? Actually, before I get these, I'm gonna do these. What do my Pisces need to hear, Spirit, regarding this situation? We have fake numbers. So someone here could be trying to get a hold of you through a fake number. Somebody really wants a piece of your energy. Okay. We have blocked. You have this person blocked, Pisces. Good job. Okay. <laughs> All right. Um, you need to know that you are protected from their energy and they cannot come through. Okay. Family mind. We have third eye closed. They can't see shit. So if someone here had... Um, the ability at one point to like remote review, remote view you or um, scry in some way, either using crystal ball or a mirror or whatever it was, a candle, whatever it was, um, somebody no longer can do so. Okay. Tell me more. We have backstabber. It says we'll do anything to get their way. So yeah, this was a backstabber. Someone here was trying to backstab you. Or if this person comes to you again, their their only ta their only intention is to backstab you. Okay, we have big mad bitch. It says they can't understand how you are so favored. It is eating up at them. So someone's upset about how protected you are. We have set up. It says don't trust them. They have something up their sleeve. Someone is trying to get you locked up. They're trying to frame you for something. They're trying to get you to lose something. Someone cannot stand that you a motherfucking star. Boom. <laughs> I can't. Tell me more what's going on with my passes. We got a conversation starter. It says they always need to check up on you for new ideas. So someone here is copying you because they don't have, they can't see shit. They don't have intuition. Their intuition is cut off. We have a cleanse. You're being asked to cleanse your aura. And then we have damage. It says they have no, or they said, it says they have major holes in their aura. And then we have misleading. It says they are trying to point you into the wrong direction. So if someone tries to come in with some sort of advice, child, be careful because this person, use your intuition, like, like the beginning of the read, use your intuition, trust your inner wisdom, because if you don't, you might be sorry. Tell me more. And you need to believe in yourself. Continue to believe in yourself. Okay, Pisces. I'm also getting like, someone here is going to get found guilty in court. What do they need to do right now, Spirit? What do they need to do? We have pray to break any and all contracts of the enemy. Okay, Pisces. Tell me more. We have it's time to manifest. It says feed your magic to achieve growth. All right. By the way, these cards are by the Pretty Oracle. Okay, you can buy them off her, I think... I think she has a link in her, what's it called? Underneath her videos in her description box. She's also a YouTuber. You guys can check that out. Okay. Tell me more. What else? What else? What else do they need to do? We have haters are present. It says pray against gossip and slander. So you got a lot of motherfuckers having your name in their mouth getting wild with it <laughs> why do we have generational okay so it says generational curses are our play it says seek to stop the pattern so you're being asked to stop the pattern here when it comes to some sort of generational curse you have in your life okay or someone or the reason why they're going so ham at you right now slandering you um all this other jazz throwing a bunch of magic at you is because um they don't want you to break some sort of generational curse okay you're being asked to listen or to recite some sort of mantras as well to help you. All right. All right. What else do my Pisces need to hear? Spirits. 
Jamel, Angel of Symbols and Dreams. It says, when you feel stuck and need guidance, ask for me for dreams to give you clarity on what course of action to take. Okay, you guys might need to work with um, Amethyst or sleep with some sort of Amethyst, okay, to help connect with Archangel Jamel. I hope I'm saying that right. Okay, there's something here about you looking for a sign or you being, you need to look for a sign or you need to pay attention to the signs or somebody here needs to. I don't know, child. Um, pay attention to your dreams. So you can avoid um, having to learn another fucking life lesson, child. <laughs> or learn this one again. This particular life lesson again, okay? Something might be happening um, within a month from now for you. We have Jafel. I don't even know if I'm saying this right, Joe. It says, expand your consciousness by taking time to appreciate beauty and revel in the lusciousness of all creation. The beauty of God. Appreciate the beauty of God. The beauty within you. The beauty of you. Okay? And others. All right? And nature and the birds and, the, and the, all the things and the stuff. Let me see. We have divine angel of guidance and truth. It says, I reveal the path to God and will restore the divine light in your heart to show you the way. Okay. Listen, something really beautiful is going to be coming in for the next four to six, in the next four to six months for you. Okay, Pisces. Like something beautiful is coming in. Okay. Um, and you're going to know it exactly where it came from. God, okay. We have um did I say this already? I think I did. Yeah, something about March. You're you're being asked to take action right now during the month of March. Take action on something. Take action on your dreams, manifesting your goals, and in the next four to six months, you're gonna amaze yourself, child, on what you can achieve. We have Angel of Hope and Peace. It says, I ignite the power of hope in your heart to help you gain victory over evil in order to establish peace in your life. Some of you might need to work with Tiger Eye at this time. Okay. This is um This is the Archangel that fights against evil. Light always wins. This is this is to help you break free and have confidence in your faith and trust in the divine. I don't know how to pronounce this. I ain't gonna even try. Okay? <laughs> I ain't gonna try. What time is it? Okay, let's get out the shells real quick and then I'm gonna bounce. Someone's first middle or last name can start with a U. We got U out here twice. We got B. We have S. We have D. We have I twice. A lot of twos. A lot of mirroring. We got E. Two E's. We got F. We got J. We got Y. We got B again. Damn. We got P. We got uh, V. We got O, we got D again, we got R, and then O again, two O's. We got C, we have N, we have X, we have G, we got F, okay? <laughs> we got two F's, two U's, a double F U to someone, child. I don't know what's going on. We got double E, double O. Who's O? Yeah, double O. You're about to have fun. We got the word fun out here. Okay. There's also somebody here that could be a fiend or someone here is fiending for your energy. You got double I, child. Come on. Someone might want to wine and dine you, okay? Or someone here could work at a diner. Something here about someone's VIN number of their vehicle. I don't know. Maybe someone's tracking your vehicle or... Uh, there's something here about a gun. We do have the word gun out here. Maybe you own a gun. Maybe 
I don't know, you need to get one. Someone's name could be Vinny. We got the word Finn. Something is ending. Someone's name is Gus. Gustavo. Someone here could drive the bus or ride the bus. Someone's name is Bruce. Someone here could have a pug, like a dog that's a pug. Someone keeps digging for something. We've got the word dig out here. Or you need to start digging. Or someone's upset because you continue to keep digging towards something. Someone here feels like something is rigged. Or something here was rigged. Someone's name is Bridget. Brittany. Someone's name is Nicole or Nick. Someone here sinned. We have the word sin out here. Something about Friday. What's today? We have BRB. <laughs> Literally, BRB is out here. Someone here could be a junior. Someone here could be vegan. Someone here is not believing someone's BS no more. Someone here was very vindictive. Or someone's now looking at someone as someone who's very vindictive. Someone's name could be Pete. Someone knows that they owe you an apology, they feel guilty, I owe you, or they owe you something. Someone needs to feed off you. We got the word feed. Or someone keeps finding you in their feed. There's something here about a video. We have the word video out here, or videos. Maybe there's videos of you or videos of someone. Someone has video of where you go. The word go. Something about a cup. Someone might put something in your cup. Be careful. We have cup out here. We have IP out here. Something in here about an IP address or something here about a private investigator that could be involved in the situation. Someone here was trying to Sweep something under the rug, but that's being lifted up. Someone, something here about someone's son, or someone's name could be Sunny. You could have a son, or someone's abandoning their son. Someone's name is Benjamin or Benny, Ben. Someone's last name could be Burn, Bernstein or Burn. Burning. Something about Facebook is significant in here. Something about Rio. Someone here could live in Rio or Reno. Reno, Nevada. Someone's name could be Fred. Freddie. Ernie, someone's name is Ernie, Ernesto. Something was happening for a year. Something about a doctor, there could be a doctor here. Something definitely about your ex. I'm done.
Okay, Pisces. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. What else do they need to hear? What do my Pisces need to hear at this time? Okay, we have resilience is one of the strongest qualities you have. It has gotten you through so many trials and tribulations in the past, and it will continue to do so. Lean on that inner tower of strength anytime that you need it. You've got this, Pisces. Ciao. Tell me more. Thank you. We have, you are not moving too slowly. Drop the self-induced pressure. You are at the sweet spot between taking care of yourself and still making advancements on your goals. On this path, there is no such thing as being behind. Smile, breathe, and carry on. Okay? What else? What else do they need to hear? We have, you need to ignore what everyone else is doing and achieving. Your life is about breaking your own limits and outgrowing yourself to live your best life. You are not in competition with anyone else. Plan to outdo your past, not other people. Well, gosh dang. Okay, Pisces. So they need to hear spirit, some motivational words. What do they need to hear? What do my Pisces need to hear? Damn. We have, she will not worry, she will be just fine. She will brave this new season one day at a time. Okay, so this is what you need to do. Just take something day by day. That's all you can do, really. That's all that anyone can do. Just take, just take everything day by day, okay? Don't put pressure on yourself. Okay, you need to have the audacity to be great, bitch. Okay? <laughs> have the audacity to be great. Great. It's a great... Tell me more, spirit. What else they need to hear? We have a river cuts through rock, not because of its power, but because of its persistence. Okay, so stay persistent on your dreams, your goals, or whatever you're trying to manifest because it's going to come through. Okay? All right, Pisces. Why do I feel like you guys need one more? Let's do the numbers. What else do they need to hear, Spirit? We have 2020. We have compassion. It is confirmation that your assumptions and beliefs are correct, but it is also an encouragement to use your talents and gifts because they will benefit the world and your pockets. Be of service to others. Your potential is enormous. Okay, Pisces. And then we got 1818. This is the last card. We have willpower. It says, wow, significant events are on the cards for you. You will progress in your endeavors and gain new experiences. The right people and resources will be put on your path. An excellent proposal or change is coming up. You're destined for greatness, bish. You're destined for greatness, baby boo. You got this. All right. This is going to be the end of your reading. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. Until next time, I love you. Okay, bye.